So you have your idea, you've done your research, and you've collected your data. You're probably wondering what type of infographic design will best represent and communicate your information. As you think about your infographic design, consider these seven common types of infographics. Number one, the list infographic supports a claim through a series of steps. It is best used to support a specific claim or argument. Your list can go from top to bottom, left to right, or can even move across your canvas. Number two, the comparison or versus infographic compares two things in a head-to-head -head study. It is best used to highlight differences between two similar things or highlight similarities between two unlike things. It is also used to prove how one option is superior or inferior to the other option. Number three, the flowchart infographic provides a specific answer to reader choices. It is best used to provide personalized answers for readers or show how multiple situations can reach the same conclusion. Number four, a visual article infographic makes a piece of writing more visual. It is best used to cut down on text or make an article more interesting and enjoyable to consume. It also increases sharing potential through social media. Number five, the map infographic showcases data trends based on location. It is best used to compare places, culture, and people through setting-centric data and demographics. Number six, the timeline infographic tells a story through chronological flow. It is best used to show how something has changed over time or make a long, complicated story easier to understand. It can also show how one thing leads to another. Number seven, a data visualization infographic communicates data through charts and graphs. It can even showcase data through design. It is best used to make data-driven arguments easier to understand and make facts or statistics more interesting to absorb. Which type of infographic will best represent your information? 